What's up guys, Jcon72 here, and in this video I'll be going over my thoughts and first impressions on PlayerUnknown's Battlegrounds closed beta. There's going to be about 4 minutes of gameplay before the actual commentary starts, but if you guys don't want to watch that, you can click the time code in the description box below and it'll take you directly to the start of the commentary. Anyways guys, enjoy the video. Okay, there's that. 762 rounds. Wait, is this 762? Oh, that is a cool animation. I like that. Wow. Look at that. I like these animations. They're cool. Except for the jumping one. The jumping one's a little wonky for me. Hey, there we go. Assault rifle. And then AK-47. Can we pick up these shoes? Oh, we did pick up the shoes. Oh, cool. We got nice shoes now. Okay. There we go. We're pretty equipped now. I'm liking this. He's dead. I'm liking this. I really like the gun mechanics right here. So, can you... How do you loot bodies? Is it possible to loot bodies now? Like in this buggy, man. Whoa. Got some explosions going. Hey, there we go. Oh, hello. Okay. That's a drift if I've ever seen one. Oh, right. We can put the, the flash hider and shit on here. Ooh. Oh, wait. We have a suppressor, don't we? Ooh. I like that. Is it? What? 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 Okay. Not entirely sure how I didn't kill that guy. Uh, but... Alright, fair enough. I hit him like... Like six times, but... GG. Guess I should should have probably used the AK on that one. For for the amount of people that make that game, it is surprisingly simple. So, well, I'm not hitting on H1Z1. I enjoy playing it. Well, now we know there's a gun on that floor. <laughs> well, there is a. Oh, there we go. There's a gun. Oh, shotgun. Yeah, I can definitely tell it's being a little laggy. I can feel it. Put a red dot on the shotgun. He did. He's hit like three times. Oh. 
Holy shit. Oh, rip. I didn't have a bandage. That was GG. That was GG. Alright, so before I go into my first impressions and thoughts on the game, I'd like to explain exactly what Battlegrounds is and where the idea of the game came from. Alright, so for those who don't know, Battlegrounds is a battle royale style game where you drop from a plane onto an island, find weapons, kill other players, and basically try to be the last one standing. Battlegrounds is being developed by Player Unknown, who also made the Arma 2, Arma 3, and H1Z1 Battle Royale mods. The H1Z1 mod is now called H1Z1 King of the Kill and is its own separate game. Now that we've got that out of the way, let's just delve right into the first thing that I think a lot of you guys are going to be interested in, and that is performance. How does this game run? Well, on my PC, I usually stay between 45 and 55 frames per second, sometimes going above that to about 60 to 65, and then also at some points going to 30 and 35 FPS. That shouldn't be too much to worry about, as I've heard within this beta testing, so the next couple of weeks, the development team will be working on performance increases, so we should see some increase in performance in the next couple of weeks. The game might not run smooth as butter right now, but the graphics and animations do have things to show for themselves. Everything I've seen so far has been really high resolution, the textures look crisp and it just looks amazing. The animations in this game are also something to marvel at. They're all super detailed and they're all extremely smooth. Nothing looks out of place. Transitioning from prone to crouch to standing is extremely fluid. Even the jumping animations and falling animations are really, really nicely done. Since we're already talking about how the game looks, why don't we talk about how it feels? I think the dev team nailed the feel of the game because when you walk into a house, you can see it's barren, it's evacuated, there's things thrown everywhere, furniture down, doors knocked over. It just feels really good. I've logged around five hours into the game so far and I'm definitely still eager to play the game. New features are going to be added all the time and even in its current state it's extremely replayable. On Friday I streamed the game for about four hours and I was definitely eager to continue playing the game that night but I wanted to put the first game I played on YouTube so I had to stop. So finally my thoughts on the game. I think it's going to be amazing, it's not quite finished yet, so it's definitely got a little ways to go, but so far I've been enjoying it a lot. Also, I think it definitely deserves its own spot on the channel, as a game I might upload once a week. I've been looking for a game somewhat like this one, just like Deadly has, and I definitely think I found my game. I wanted to post H1Z1 previously, but it just didn't really fit into the channel too much, but this one definitely fills that void. So, will you be seeing videos of this game on the channel? That is a definite yes. I'll record as much gameplay as I can over the next couple of weeks on the weekends because that's the only time the servers will be up, and I'll definitely try to get a couple of videos out here and there. Would I recommend this game to you? Definitely, but it's not for everyone. If you enjoy H1Z1, if you enjoy Arma 3, if you enjoy DayZ, then this is definitely a game that you're going to want to look into. Now, there's no official release date on Steam yet. The only way you can get the closed beta is to redeem a code, so there isn't actually a Steam store page for it yet, but I assume it'll be between $30 and $60. There isn't really much else to say, so if you think I've missed something important, then definitely put it in the comments below, and I'll make sure to get back to you. But anyways, guys, that's about it for this video. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe for more Battlegrounds and DayZ content, and I'll see you guys in the next one.